Uh, hello friends, so in this video I will talk about how to run the uh, basic simulation inside the Floca software. So I will explain step by step how to start with the Floca software. So I already installed the Floca software and also the Flayer. Flayer is a Floca advanced interface. It allows to interact with the Floca using the GUI. So if you want a video on how to install the Floca and the Flayer software then you can mention in the comment then I will create this video. Uh, so let's start with the uh, Floca simulation. So for that I already have installed the Flayer. So I will type on the terminal Flayer ampersand and it will open the window for the Flayer. Now you can see that the window is open. Then I will go with the basic example. There are few basic examples. So, so if you click here new and then you can see that basic then I can open the basic example. And then uh, you can see in the input file now you can see also new project file has been created basic dot player. Now you can see this project in the input. So now you can see that input file is created and here we have a cylindrical target and the radius of the target is 5 cm and the height is 10 cm HZ is 10 cm so if you see in the geometry you can see this uh, target so if you just see that the radius is basically this is 10 cm it is 5 cm and in the Z direction distance is 10 cm now I can save this file in the, the current directory let's say tutorial 1 and then the the extension is the flare save okay now it's it already have the geometry and it already has assigned the material then what we can do we can start to score the quantities so for the scoring the quantities you can add a card here so scoring the user i can add the user win card and then i can score the energy loss inside this material inside this region so here you can type 21 win and then you can type the name here energy loss energy loss and then the R minimum is 0 to 0 0.5 or we can mention to 10 10.0 and Z minimum is 0 to let's say 15 so this is the basically scoring region which I basically creating the larger size than the cylinder so and then you can mention the winning 100 and then you can also mention the winning in 500 and the mention the winning in Z is 100 okay or we can mention 200 for example if you want with a fine binning then you can mention 200 200 now what I want to score here I want to score the energy loss so I can create the energy and then what you can do here now you can also specify the number of events here so if, it, if you click here default is 5000 and I, I don't want to run for 5000 so then I can I can put the number of events here number of primaries is 100 let's say so that it runs uh, very quick so now I save it and then I go to the geometry and then I can see the geometry and target these all things and then I can click on the run and then I can do the start then you can see it is start running and it will take time to run it, it is telling the time is around 23 seconds so I can wait for the uh, so it's basically increasing the time so once it's completed uh, I will get the files for the Floca so let's wait for the completion and then we will see how to process the data
and then now it's completed you can see that it is finished and okay and then you can go to the data and then you can do the processing of the data basically we do the data merging and then you can just go to the plot and then here you can create the normalized plots click on it this is basically if you click on it then it creates the normalized it's basically normalized by the per, per event so then if you plot this chat profile just click on it now you can see that the energy deposition profile inside the cylinder so you can clearly see that uh, the energy deposition and also uh, this is the color plot and for the title etc you can see my previous video here you can add the title these all things you can do the settings and then for the number of normalization by the number of events here you can do that for this is for example this plot is created for one primary so if you want to scale by 100 then you can just put the normalization factor 100 here and then it will basically normalize by the number of events so uh, this is how you can create uh, the energy loss profile using the basics in basics uh, input file and you can do the several settings here so once you create it you can also create the eps file for example i can click on hit ca and then i can click on eps then it will create the eps profile let's go to the download now you can see that i already created the eps file which is basically high resolution file you can just see it so these settings you can also quickly do inside this window so so it completes the simulation and then let's go one more thing the same plot you can also create here for example you can go to the layer we can do the layer and then i would add a layer here let's say layer one okay okay and then option add and then user bin okay okay layer add i already added it okay now layer one we can go to layer one and then user bin okay and then you can upload the file here for example 21 okay now you can visualize this file once you apply here now you can visualize layer one now you can see that how it looks like energy loss profile so this is how you can basically create uh, the uh, uh, basic simulation inside the uh, Fluka and you can basically run the advanced simulation also. So this is all. Thank you very much.